What's up, guys? Uh, this is going to be a review on Insecure. Um, I think I'm kind of disappointed with this episode, but it's only the first episode, and it is the final season. And the show is only, like, 28 minutes long, so they can only put so much in it. And it just wasn't... It didn't give what they said it was going to give. It was some funny moments, and it was some okay moments, and it was some weird moments also. I want to be Team Issa because I was Team Issa last time. So I want to stay Team Issa. But okay, let's go, just go into it. Um, What was wrong with Molly Wig tonight? I wasn't feeling no wig. So another thing is, you know how everyone has that one friend that they just had to leave behind? Hell, I could have been that friend that you just had to leave behind. And, and the friend that robbed them, she was the friend that we should have left behind. And also, I think that this, this show, this season, well, this episode covers, like, how the balance of friendships go. Like, you know, people always say things like, oh, she'll forget that man, but she don't forgive her friend. But realistically, what you don't see between her and that man is, that's just how it is, the way it was just with Issa and Molly, like, it's still awkward in the household. It's still awkward when we go out because somebody is still holding something in. Everything wasn't said. And I think that's what this shows. Like, it shows that relationships has ups and downs. And, you know, like, if the relationship means something to you, you just have to fight for it. And that's just that on that. I was very shocked to see that she was still actively with Lawrence and Lawrence is so fine. Like blow my mind. He is so fine to me, y'all. Oh, he is so fine. But I was very surprised, but I wasn't surprised with the decision that she had made because when you reflect back, like a baby is forever. And yeah, that's just that on that. And you gotta know if you wanna deal with it. All right, so moving forward, what they said we're gonna see in this season. It's still not giving, I think it's giving us just a little, but not enough to even say nothing about. Like, I feel like everything was so short tonight and nothing really happened to the point that this video, this review was short. The first episode, if, if, out of five stars, I would give it three and a half. Hopefully, we get to five by, by the third episode. Um, the thing with Kelly, I thought that was really nice. I am a now firm believer that we should receive our flowers while we can smell them. I feel like you should tell people how you feel about them and how much you appreciate them. Why they're here on earth? Because what's the point of you standing there with the two minute remarks when I'm in the casket and I can't hear you? Uh -uh, tell me that now, girl, so we can cry together. Like, yes. And that's it. I don't know nothing else. Like, I'm trying to think. Molly, um, very much so overanalyze and overthink things. And that could be a her thing that she really sometimes projects on everyone else. But also, Issa is, um, she gives you, she's a tad bit selfish, why it's kind of spoiled and title. I don't know what you want to give it. So sometimes she come up nonchalant when Molly is expressing herself about her situations and her issues. The nonchalant can come off almost as like, girl, I don't care about that. Can we talk about me? And I guess that's just her. That's the problem. That's toxic. Because that's how we brush off things that we shouldn't be brushing off. That's just her. That's toxic as heck. It is. I'm not drinking tonight, y'all. Cause let me tell you, this is a whole different subject. I'm my I, giving up drinking is nothing because I'm a social drinker. But another thing that I want to give up is my foul potty mouth. That is not working for me. I can't. I am when I say I'm trying hard. I'm as I'm talking, I'm thinking of substitutions. This is some hard ish, but I'm gonna stay dedicated. Don't judge me because I still might be like, damn, and I still might give you the S word because listen, he ain't done working on me. He's still working through me. But I'm still excited for this. I watched the re um the reunion. I watched the whole marathon today, and 
I hope they give me more. So I feel like the teaser that um, was given to us that somebody was going to die on the episode, that must have been the episode somebody is going to die on. That's what I think. I don't know, but I hope you guys enjoyed this. If I missed something, just tell me in the comments. Make sure you like and subscribe so you can know about more. I could have put on some earrings. I could have. This um outfit, if y'all want to know, <laughs> this outfit is Pretty Little Things. The only thing I don't like about Pretty Little Things, the hit and miss, and this is off subject, on subject, is the size. And this is an XX. This is an XXL. And I'm usually like uh, 18, 20. So I felt like this should fit me right. This is so big. Let me see. First of all, it's folded. And it's just, you see how it's falling off. And it's just because the way I'm laying, the way it looks. But it's just a lounge set. So it's giving what it needs to be given. I'll see you guys the next time. See you guys the next time because I will be doing a review every Sunday on Insecure. And Molly wig was a mess. I can't wait till she cut her hair.